Up close, you look even scarier. Oh, look at him walking. <laughs> you thought it was over, did you? Well, no. Today, we are back in Five Nights at Freddy's security breach, where today I'm doing something special that I don't think many people have done. I have a full cheats menu available in the game. So there's quite a few things that I want to try. I am in a completely different save. I am at 1 a.m., I think. I'm on security level two. And there's a reason that I did that because I didn't want to corrupt my main save just in case we go and do some other stuff. And I want to prove to you that this works. So I haven't actually tried it yet. However, let's press this and it should come up any second now. Yes, there it is. This is the debug menu for security breach. If you're excited for this, leave a like, subscribe if you're brand new as well. That would be awesome. So we can do a lot of things. We can unlock everything, lock everything, teleport, coordinates, change our security level, change our field of view. There's so much. You can literally add anything you want to your inventory. What kind of stuff am I seeing here? Um, rare item nine, ultra item one, uncommon. You can add jump scares to your inventory. The cube of testing, strange cube, thingamabob, <laughs> what on earth? Freddy slash Gregory. Oh, we can give literally everything to Freddy. So let's, um, let's do that. Missions, you can access every single mission. What are these though? Roxy boss, Vanny boss, burn trap boss. Oh my God, it was called burn trap. Okay, that makes sense. Instruction cards and just random other stuff which we'll try out too first up let's unlock everything <laughs> and see what happens so we should have faz oh no oh, i've got the achievements okay i'm a bad person and then we've got this as well i don't know what the vip achievement is maybe it's collecting every item that could be it i'm a bad person please don't copy me uh, let's go into inventory. Oh, look at this weird stuff. What's this? Nightmare Helpy. Helpy and Nightmare Helpy. A hoodie upgrade. What's the hoodie upgrade? Baking bag. The mystery mix, which we've already found. They must have changed it. Clothing is like a full menu. And this is where all the random items are. Strange cube, cube of testing, thingamabob. The CDs. Okay, that, I need to work on the CDs. Tragedy and comedy mask. Dude, there is so much stuff in this game. I thought I'd found pretty much everything, but uh, apparently not. I don't know what the hoodie upgrade is. That's really random. Anyway, what I really want to try out here is security level 100. And now I want to go into flying mode also. I don't know what that's going to do. It could also crash. I have no idea. Oh. I got it to work. Here it is. Check it out. Flying mode. So we're not even playing as Gregory right now. We are just a separate entity flying around. This is dope. It's cool how Gregory has a full character, but I guess we've kind of seen that already because you have the cameras on the watch. Now, apparently I should be able to clip through everything. What? This is going to be super buggy because it's a very hitchy game anyway. But this is sick. Does this mean we'll be able to see all of the animatronics as well? Just roaming around? I guess we can. Now we can see what's behind these doors. Oh, this is a corridor we haven't seen before. This is an exit room, isn't it? So we can go through here and that's the actual exit door. But it doesn't let you go through to this corridor. That's kind of cool. Yeah, look, everyone's operational. This is the laundry room. Wait, you spotted me? How can you see me? What on earth? Yeah, this is where I wanted to be. Check it out. We're in the main area just flying around. This is nuts. Now, I'm pretty sure there is a security level 10 door right here. Yeah, it says 10 on it. I could fly right through it. But I kind of want to bring Gregory over here and open it normally because I could do that. So give me a second. I'll reload and get security level 100 and then come over here. So we want security level 100. I wonder what this does as well. I want to change this to 100 as well. Oh. Oh, if only they had an actual FOV slider. This looks so good. What else do we want to get? We want to get... 
Unlimited stamina. We want everyone shattered as well. I don't know what the Vanny meter is. We want all the upgrades for Freddy right now. And we can change the clock to 6 a.m. I think that's all done. Oh, I also want the Faz Blaster as well. I want to try 120 on this. Oh, that looks so good. I don't know if I'm just used to it in Minecraft, but look at the FOV. Oh, I wish you could play like this the whole time. Right, I'm going to go to that security door. I have the Faz Blaster. I have everything ready to go and unlimited stamina. This is this is cool. <laughs> I'm hacking. This is what I was looking for. Everything just looks so much better. You can see so much with the FOV much higher. Here it is. The security level 10 door. Shall we open it? Let's see. Oh, wait. I didn't actually expect it to have anything in. Wait, hold up. We got bins, loads of random shelving, and a staircase. I didn't actually expect this to have anything in it. There's umbrellas in here. So they've actually dressed this. I thought this was going to be hidden for a reason. There's a plush down here. What's through this door? Oh, okay. Never mind. Yep, yeah, we're um we're in the void. <laughs> Oh, God. There is a void. It's cool that there's actually something behind it, though. Right, let me go and find some other security level 10 doors. I'm sure there was a level 10 in here. Was it this one? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was this one. There's screens up there. Oh, that bit's the... um, That's the mini game at the top where you kind of have to block the doors and zap them. Okay. I kind of want to walk in. There's another door down there. But if I walk in, I think I'm going to... Wait, hold on. You can actually go through them? Freddy's T-posing! Oh, this is a perfect Easter egg. <laughs> He's T-posing. Right, you can actually go in here. Find lift could... Oh, God. I'm, I'm triggering all kinds of stuff right now. I actually feel weird. Oh, this is this section. Okay, that makes sense. We've been here before. You just can't come back here because there's the stage 10, I think. Next on my list is trying Sun's room. So you remember the daycare? I don't know what's going to trigger because I can't remember where we are in the story. But I want to go in Sun's room where he jumps out at the beginning and see if there's anything behind there. I obviously, there might not be, but it's worth checking. There's also band doors I want to go in or go behind as well. But let's see what we can find. Slide. Security oh, no! alert! Security alert! Woo, 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 woo! No, 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 no. Don't snitch. No one likes a snitch. So can you not go down here? <laughs> He's like, oh, I love the two sun and moon animatronics. They're so sick. Fine, if you don't let me in, I'm busting in. This is the room right here. It does have some decoration to it. Oh, oh, I am so dumb. This is where you get that secret golden plush. No way. This is where the Balloon World minigame is. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Some of you guys probably put it in the comments when I was in here, but... My fun day, me. Oh, this is so strange. I did not think that's where Sun came out of. That's weird. That's that's who was living there the whole time. That's actually mad. Look at the mess that he lives in, though. It's kind of gross. Is he drawing these or are these like visions from me? Because look, he's like drawn me with Freddy and a pizza. But Freddy's got these crazy claws and stuff. <laughs> That is not what I thought was behind there. Right, Gregory, where are we going next? We're in the bowling area because I want to see if there's anything behind this curtain right here. Is Bonnie here? Because Bonnie's been missing the whole time. No trace at all. Let's see if there's anything behind here. There is a stage. There is Bonnie Bowl, but that is it. That is the only thing that's behind here. It's so weird seeing the behind the scenes of a game that you're not meant to see. <laughs> but the stage is there. It's fully formed. If Bonnie would like to make a return, she can. Next thing I want to try is in missions. You can try these bosses. Vanny boss, I don't know what that is. Burn trap. Let's click that. It doesn't actually do anything. Oh, no, wait, it does. What have I done? I clicked it way too many times. Oh, it just puts you there? It just puts you right here? It teleports you there. That's kind of cool. Now, the reason I want to go down here is because I want to go to that final room 
and then use the fly and see what happens. I am definitely sure. Let's go. God, this game looks so much better with this massive field of view. It looks... Sorry. Oh, I haven't actually seen that guy up close. He's freaky. Let's go. Oh, there's doors here as well that we haven't opened. Okay, that's just the desk. And there's just voids behind there. I wonder if there is actually stuff, though. Problem is, when we go into flying mode, I can't get out of it. So I'm going to go down here. I think I gave Freddy all his upgrades, so we should be good. Oh, nope, you are on low power. Do not kill me now, buddy. Can you not get in? Um, <laughs> no. Okay, this is a problem. This is a big problem. Can you make it down there? So I think if I go down here by myself, I get jump scared, right? Let's see what happens. Oh, it won't let me down there. That's kind of crazy. I think I'm going to get jump scared. I think I'm going to get jump scared. Freddy, can you come down here, please? Ah! <laughs> oh my god, that scared me. I knew it was I knew something was coming, but I haven't actually been jump scared by that before. Freddy, you need to protect me next time. Since Freddy won't come down with me, I'm going to have to fly and see what happens. This is... I don't want to get jump scared again. Is this it? This is it here. Wait, is this different? Wait, what is this? Are these the Afton rooms? Yeah, because these are the corridors right here. This is the room that you're in. But this is the corridor you go down. And these are the rooms that you see. Again, very dirty little boiler room. And this is where he starts to hack Freddy. These are the things you cook him with. <laughs> kind of crazy that there's a recharge point in here. Why would that... Why would that be there? And then there's the third room here. Maybe he recharges himself? It's cool to see these rooms, though. Oh, doesn't he get out of that? In the cutscene? Yeah, I think he gets out of this. Because this is pre-cutscene right now. Oh, this is the vent. They actually modeled the entire vent as well. I kind of want to see how this works when the actual boss fight is happening. This is the jump scare material right here. Oh, that's actually quite a scary animatronic. The way it's breathing and stuff. There's Chica with stuff coming out of her mouth. Is Bonnie in here? Yeah, maybe. That might be Bonnie's hand. Oh, there's Baby there too. Oh, it's made up of loads of different ones. Foxy's in there. Wait, what? Is that fun time, Foxy? This is cool to see. Actually, I think this autosave right here is the autosave before the boss fight. It is. Okay, this is my legit save. But we are going to completely destroy it. Now, because we're further in the game, we should be able to have all the upgrades for freddy we should be able to charge as well and go down and trigger the cutscenes. okay i still can't charge freddy can go down though but i can charge when i'm down here here we go avoid the jump scare at least we got to see a new jump scare that was kind of cool and then we fall down here here we go so I need to go, when we're in there, we need to go into fly mode and just see what happens. I want to see who is in the vent as well. Oh, this is why you can see in the vent, because it's in the cutscene. There he is. Oh, he's so cool. I wish you could, like, play as him or something. They need a Five Nights at Freddy's game from the animatronic perspective. That would be so good. There he is. What was that? Let's push it. Let's okay? go quickly into flying mode with no collision. Yeah, here we go. Here what we is go. that thing? <laughs> oh, it's weird seeing this. He's in here, so we can go through there. There he is. Holy. I never realized you look so freaky. Up close, you look even scarier. Okay, that's the scariest animatronic. Look at that. Chica. Okay, Chica's Chica. gone. We are going to die, though, which is a problem. Oh, look at him walking. That's so dope. <laughs> We're going to die. And this is him hacking him through the thing. Chica's coming. Chica's coming. I didn't actually see what happens when Freddy gets taken over. Is it just a jump scare, maybe? Even this looks weird in third person. Gregory's looking at the floor like, no. No. <laughs> if I don't look, it's not happening. We just saw him jump scare in third person. That was actually kind of sick. So you can watch all of the animatronics get you in third person with this mod. That's so good. Next on my list, the band doors. I think I might need to go into flying mode to open these. 
because I can't just walk in there as Gregory. So, number one, let's go inside and see what is in here. Nothing. Nothing behind this one. There is two doors, though. This one's smaller. Oh, wait, there's a door here. Something's going to load. Oh. Oh, that stall. Where's that door, then? There's, like, a secret arcade in here. Have we been here? I don't think we have. There's a game table. Are we in the other side of the daycare? I think we are. So you come in there, which when you come in, the door disappears, which is super weird. And then what if we go through this door? Oh, it's the secret room down here. The Fazcade in the, in the daycare, but it's got these one-way mirrors on. So no, we've never been in there before, but you can actually access it and it's got loads of arcade games in it. That's kind of crazy. I, again, I want to play all of these games, but they're not active. That's kind of cool. So there are loads of hidden areas that are all built and ready to go, but they haven't been accessed yet. So maybe, just maybe there might be some DLC. There's an actual crane game here too with moon and sun in. <laughs> Let me just test that by going back through here. We should end up where Gregory is. Gregor! Yeah, there he is. Hey, buddy. You know what? I never really got a good look at you. With no eyes, it kind of looks like you've been bleeding. She's got the eye sockets, but nothing else. God, these animatronics are so cool. I love the destroyed versions more than the actual versions. <laughs> One other thing I've just thought of are these right here. So this is Glamrock's beauty salon. I don't know if there's going to be anything behind here. Oh, those are the doors that lead into this bit. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. We didn't spend a lot of time in this area, but it was a really cool area. Apart from that, I don't think there's anything new. There's just a random backstage area here. Where have we ended up now? Where, where are we? Oh, we're up in the stands of Roxy Raceway. We haven't actually seen the raceway because the raceway is a cutscene. You can't actually get onto the track. But here it is. I wish there was a mini game to play on this, though. That would be so good. If the boss fight could have involved some form of actual driving, that would have been really nice. But hey, you know what? I think that's all I can think of for doing today. Let me know in the comments section down below if there's anything else that you would like me to try. I think I've covered everything. I covered some of the security 10 doors, the shutter doors you can't get past. But I hope you enjoyed and thought this was interesting if you did leave a like that'd be awesome subscribe if you're brand new and i'll see you in the next one superstars <laughs> bye